Increase your sales using affiliate newsletters. For people with affiliate programs, are you sending a regular newsletter to your affiliates? Do you know how significant of a role that they play? Here's why you should be sending those newsletters to your affiliates on a regular basis. You can update affiliates on your new products, contests, etc. You can inform the affiliates of any policy changes or new tools for them to use. And you can answer any questions that may come up. Using these newsletters, you can also stay in touch and hence remain relevant in the affiliate's mind. You can keep reminding them to promote your products. Use catchy subject lines. Using catchy subject lines will increase your email open rate. The subject line should make it clear that the letter is specifically written for affiliates and not consumers and that you have exciting and serious stuff inside. For example, you can begin your newsletter with the highest commission that it was paid the previous week. This works well at getting your emails read and also as inspiration to the affiliates. Another great opener is by greeting the affiliate and thanking them for promoting your products. This reminds them of their connection to you and exactly who you are. For example, hello Andrea. We're grateful you promote our products at mywebsite.com. Highlight the main topics at the beginning of the newsletter to show what's inside. Putting some of your topics too far down will result in many affiliates not seeing them as opposed to showing them towards the top. For this reason, you should use a bullet list. You can also hyperlink them to the appropriate areas of the newsletter. This will make it easy for affiliates to find the information that they want. Before their launch, give affiliates your latest product for free. By doing this, you will enable the affiliates to get familiar with the product, hence they can talk about it with authority to prospective customers. Give affiliates enough notice. To enable your affiliates to execute their duties properly, you should give them plenty of notice to things like codes for discounts that they can offer, sales, coupons, discontinuations, contests, etc. Use plain old text to write your emails unless you are in the high-tech industry. This is because plain old text loads faster on phones. It is slightly more likely to be read by the recipient and is less likely to get flagged as spam. If you are in an industry that expects a lot of flash, such as high tech, I would advise you to use HTML. Again, if you want to display your product in a banner, also use HTML. In a case where you are not sure, I would advise that you go back to the basics, which are plain old text. Offer your affiliates the chance to be on an exclusive list of flash sales. Flash sales are those sales with a significant discount that doesn't last long and they at times come with little to no warning. The reason for offering this is because some affiliates like being proactive and like to be notified in advance. Others won't mind and will gladly appreciate the opportunity regardless. Point affiliates to your forum or Facebook group where you ask for their thoughts and their needs. This will keep communications on a two-way street instead of just sending them a survey and taking up their time. You can also conduct just a short poll. Asking affiliates what they think of something might give you some surprising insights. Provide a call to action at the end of the newsletter. By doing this, you will be providing the affiliate with answers as to what you want them to do. Should they call you for more information, visit your website to get the codes for your new banner, you will have already told them what action to take. Send your affiliate newsletters weekly instead of monthly. As long as you have relevant information to share with the affiliates, they would prefer to hear from you on a weekly basis. Conclusion Always test your newsletters before sending them out. This will allow you to check for spelling errors, formatting errors, inaccurate information, etc. Also make sure to include your contact information in every newsletter for the affiliates so that if they need to contact you for more information, they know where to find you.